when a body of mass when a body is moved from is moved from pole to equator not equated to pole when a body is moved from pole to equator comma what will be the what will be the here we have to make a correction when a body is moved from pole to equator what will be the decrease in weight decrease in weight decrease in weight of the body decrease in weight of the body this is earth and uh, axis of the earth we can draw the equator this circular line means the equator north pole and south pole of earth earth rotates about its own axis from west to east with an angular velocity omega and this circular plane is the equator this circular line circular orbit is the equator of earth acceleration due to gravity at north pole is g lambda p and acceleration due to gravity at equator is g lambda p the acceleration the acceleration due to gravity the acceleration due to gravity at north pole at north pole of earth is given by g lambda p equal g minus omega square r cos square lambda g since uh, angle of latitude at north pole at north pole or at any pole lambda equal 90 degree that's why g lambda p will be equal to g not zero so it should be therefore g lambda p equal 0 the acceleration due to gravity at the pole is g lambda p is equal to 0 which is maximum g lambda p equal g which is maximum similarly the acceleration due to gravity due to gravity at the equator at the equator is given by g lambda e equal g minus omega square r cos square lambda where angle of latitude at the equator lambda is equal to 0 degree where lambda equal to 0 degree at uh, the equator hence so we can say that g lambda e so now uh, at the north pole g lambda p equal g and lambda equal 90 degree and at the equator g lambda e and lambda equal 0 degree at the equator. So we get g lambda e as g minus omega square r. g lambda e equal g minus omega square r. If a body, a body of mass m is placed at north pole, m is the mass of the body at uh, north pole and it is moved from north pole to equator the body is uh, mo moved from north pole to equator and the body uh, exists at equator and weight of the body at pole is w lambda p and weight of the body at equator is capital w lambda e if a body of mass m if a body of mass m is moved from pole to equator is moved from pole to equator percentage change in percentage change in its weight will be percentage change in in its weight will be delta w divided by w lambda p into 100 is equal to 
W lambda E minus W lambda P divided by W lambda P into 100. Where W lambda P equal M G lambda P which is the weight of the body at the pole. Which is the weight of the body at the pole or at north pole. Similarly W lambda E equal M G lambda E which is the weight of uh, the body at the equator which is the weight of the body at the equator therefore delta w divided by w lambda p into 100 is equal m g lambda p g lambda e minus m g lambda p divided by m g lambda p into 100 equal g lambda e minus g lambda p divided by g lambda p into 100 cancelling the mass from numerator and denominator now putting the expression of g lambda e and g lambda p we get g minus omega square r minus g divided by g into 100 equal minus omega square r divided by g into 100 w delta w divided by w lambda p into 100 is equal to minus omega square r divided by g into 100 that is the percentage change in weight of the body now omega square r divided by g is equal 1 by 289 where omega where angular velocity of rotation of earth angular velocity of rotation of earth about its own axis omega equal 2 pi divided by time period of revolution or time period of rotation where and t equal 24 hours equal 86,400 second and capital R is equal 6.4 into 10 to the power 6 meter which is the radius of earth 6.4 into 10 to the power 6 meter and g is equal 9.8 meter per second square so delta w divided by lambda w lambda p into 100 is equal to minus 100 divided by 289 that is the percentage change in weight of the body when it is take, moved from pole to equator and is equal minus 0 0.346 minus 0 0.346 minus 0 0.346 percent Hence, when a body is moved from pole to equator, when a body is moved from pole to equator, its weight decreases by, its weight decreases by 0.346 percent, decreases by 0.346 percent. Negative sign indicates that weight decreases by 0.346 percent. Weight of the body at pole is W lambda p and omega is the angular velocity of rotation of earth. W lambda p is the weight of uh, the body at pole. Now uh, the body has mass m. W lambda p is the weight of the body at pole and if the body is moved from pole to equator in that case uh, weight of the body of mass m at uh, the equator will be w lambda e w lambda e is the weight of the body at uh, the equator and delta w divided by w lambda p into 100 is equal to minus 0 0.346 percent hence weight decreases by 0 0.346 percent